Ekonene. Ekonene. Episode 32. We are back. Eh, yeah, kuna ninja zikoz na shindo je zira yasi menda wapi? Kuna tunai, kuna tunai, si ndio? Waze. Lagi sa tu berudi. Berudi. Eh, wacha tu shout out wote kadha. Uh, kuna Africa Beats. Kuna Ibrahim Orwa. Kuna Yobra na kuna Billy Raptivist and of course uh, the usual suspects. Uh, Sinojo kuna lazima tutaje Joy, yeah. Gidenji, uh, um, Omedo. Mm. Cuz Omedo to end up tukiagina ye eh, online. I hope I take personal. Mr. Yeah. Omedo, I just want to know kando. We got to create need to have debate na Mr. Omedo. Debate maybe alikuwa ya kijaka. Oh. Eh, yeah, or through nini? Eh, itwa through ngozi ine. I, I think to have na eh, debate <laughs> jeo. Okay. Eh, story, yeah. Yeah. Uh, but it's all love at the end of the day. Uh, yeah. So usual suspects yeah. committee yeah kina yeah, yeah kina kina research yenyewe yeah, kitu amekalia kutufanyia research jo kuna uh, post nyingine kwa meka haiko research but yeah. hiyo weka post zingine mrefu eh yeah, kuziweka gani ni yeah. yeah, yeah. so shout out to kina way back hawa se wote wale eh yeah, eh yeah. Akila mtu leo kuna tuuliza tunarudi lini? Eh. Kabla leo nimesema ati tunarudi akina Mazdel wote walikuwa <laughs> nasema eh, it's, it's about times najua. Eh. Uh, but um, ilikuwa necessary. Alafu uh, mm. tumefurahi ni finally tulifikisha vile tulifikisha 1000. Uh, yeah. Tumeza ku monetize. Yeah. Uh, so tumeanza ku make a few coins here and there. Mm. Not enough to support the show. Not enough. But, but... at least in onsha you are watching and you are not skipping ads. Yeah. And ama if, if you're skipping at least you're letting it play kidogo so we appreciate <laughs> yeah uh, cuz tuna hope um, when we start making something nice from mm. it we hope to even do more complex stuff na yeah, like more yeah. mm. and also peer do like an east african tour or something so that would be nice mm. 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 Uh, so these two weeks what have you been up to wewe said yako eh uh, imekuwa tu ni kupumzika mazee eh yeah, kuna vile mwili ilikuwa ime, ime, imefika mwisho mm. jiona mm. jiona apart from this to kona vitu zingine yeah, tunafanya yeah, yeah, so as yeah. it was nafanya mwili na ina inachoka mbaya yeah. mm. so nime rest sana mm. um makuna kitu ya maana nimefanya ile mm. yeah because me me uh, really make mistake mm. siju kani ushamba ama nini mm. but kuna kwa gani tuseme ukiwa na haraka mtakuishia place uh, nataka u brush meno haraka alafu toke mm. sajua So mimi mistake mu make nikiwa na haraka nataka kunini na grab like some listerine na jo mouthwash yeah. Yeah. Lakitu kitu moja nishai notice every time nikitumia listerine after mm. some a few days later mm. i have a very bad uh, toothache mm. basa hizi sandal nimeza ku connect dots cuz mm. notice it's not me so just squeeze one and the web md check one kuna singe anasema hivyo like mm. uh, kuna vile like mouthwash ga ina affect meno zao mm. So ili ni happen ya last year. Mm. Alafu kanika stop kutumia hiyo mouthwash. Mm. Basa ma juices juu kwa naishi hapi. Pale nilikuwa na haraka. So nika grab nika spit. Mm. Wacha nianze kuumwa na meno like a few days later. Mm. Alafu the last time vile uh, niliumwa mm. ilikuwa last year mm. ilishia kwa doctor fulani nikamwambia eh nilitumia hii nini ndio ikanileta hii ishote. Mm. That be a problem. Mm. Kaniambia z Mm. Ah, hakuna vile hiki tunaweza kosa. Eh, so akaniambia, hey, you need to go and see a gum specialist." Nje some ish. Yeah. Ngamza like hakuna kitu ninasumbua na gums zangu. So mm. through the process le medicine alinipatia never siku fuatilia. Yeah. So this time ika come tena. Yeah. Nasema nirudi kwa ule msema niende kwa mse tofauti. Nikaenda nimeenda kwa mse tofauti. Mm. So mse akaangalia, alafu uh, so kitu interesting ni ukimwona meno moja, mm. wagono mwana ile iko directly above it. Ojo hivyo. Mhm. Ushai kwa na toothache. Mhm. You are lucky. Lucky. Eh, hey, yeah. So ukiumwona <laughs> hii no kwa wood kwa ya. Oh, pole pole. <laughs> <laughs> so ukiumwona ka hii meno ya chini, yeah. automatically ile iko juu yeah. exactly itaanza yeah. kuuma because yeah. apparently they share the same nerve. Okay. So ta assume eh kwa nini umwona meno mbili? Yeah. So inaka hii listerine nikitumia iko ina pitia through maybe i have like a, a small like cavity. Mm. Sasa inaingia huko ndani ina mess na mimi na manavs kabisa. Mm. So ni njenge kaniambia like uh, anaitwa dentist mwingine kaniambia the easiest way to solve this mm. is to do uh, inaitwa root canal. Root canal. Yeah. Uh, so afterwards and then kufanya filling. Mm. E mtu wangu root canal I would not wish it on my worst enemy. Mm. I'd wish it on my worst enemy. Mtu wangu tu. Yaani niliingia 
uh, alianza kunini first of all una check kile ki kisindano kisindano yeah. alafu this time they target the nerve yeah. alafu you nerve lazima idungwe mara ka tatu yeah. they go numb yeah. mtu wangu niliwika jo nilio hey! <laughs> <laughs> wa wow. nili go through hell yani zilidungwa mara tatu mm. alafu unajua ajioni na kam eh kamtoyeta nipatie kamtoy story mm. ati vile niliumwa mm. sika alikuwa kana check <laughs> kusiota ni contract kuambia like niliumwa ufai kwenda kwa dentist ju meno zako lazima cuz meno zake zimeshindwa kudunda so unajua mm. mm. zina mm. but sasa hiyo shit like i would not wish it on my worst enemy My worst enemy needs to get a root canal. So mm. kudanganya. Mm. Wow. But sasa uzuri ni the actual feeling itself ni painless. Yeah. So now the pain is o nini? Like yeah. when you're going through that. Yeah. So now when I went for the feeling like a week later, nilibebata mm. kamtoi. Mm. Ataka alikuwa hapo kaki kaki record mm. na 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 phone. Mm. Love kitu kwa interesting ni vile tuliingia, kalikuwa kanaambia doctor uh, na ni dentist like, "Oh, he's so scared and he's so old." <laughs> He's scared. <laughs> eh, so your story will last some gati. I'll not wish it. Unajanga hiyo jinga. I'll yeah, wish it on my worst. Yeah. Yeah. Una believe in that phrase? No. Because that phrase is bullshit. Yeah. As in if you're my worst enemy, I so want don't you think to I have suffer. A, do you have an enemy? Not not uh, to that level. Oh, yeah. Yeah, as in kuna kuna rayo wa mkasubiko like that's my enemy. No. Hakuna mtu anaishi kwa kwa kichwa wangu hiyo. Yes, ndio so. Rent free. <laughs> so by the time say anakuwa not just an enemy but your worst enemy. Worst enemy. You're supposed to wish the worst on this person. Yeah. Unajua. Yeah. Yeah. So so you doctor nili nilipitia hiyo 2 weeks. Mm. Wa, wow. yani mpaka saa hizi niko niko serious design. Tikizi vitu sombe gamtoi like mtoi kabla lalo naambia brush it mm. wake up brush. Yeah. Ai sasa hizi joni 3 times a day. Sitaki mm. kujua. Mm. Kitiabe cha cha. <laughs> But any time there's something chata, chata. sugary. Yeah yeah yeah. Yeah, yeah cuz kuna zile vitu uh, unachukua lakini still I blame the first doctor. Cuz mm. of your mis diagnosis. Vile aliniambia stories za uh, nini? Aliniambia stories za uh, inaitwa nini? That I need gum surgery bit kind of. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. alafu Mr. Zack tumekuwa on holiday for long. Yeye kitu unaona ikiwa green inafaa kuwa red. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so um so that happened mm. uh what else alafu in the process um you took on a lot of time in our hands yeah they kind up nikki watch uh, a certain uh, documentary lili ile ni shtua sana mm you are misdiagnosis acha kitu mefikile level um ya like at our age mm. tunafaa kuwa tuna have like frequent medical checkups, checkups yeah unajua mm. na when you go to have a medical checkup The number one thing is you trust your doctor. Mm. Anything that your doctor tells you, you're going to trust. Mm. So kuna ira ilikuwa ga US, the capital country, kama kuna capital country, what is the capital city? Mm. But the capital country of capitalism. Mm. Ninja ni Dr. Farid Fata. Ah, uh, alafu ilikuwa ga msa wa cancer, mm. like an oncologist. Umse ilikuwa naishia. Mimi na wewe tungeishia, wewe uishie jana mimi niende leo. Mm. Sio hata tuna cancer je. <laughs> alafu mm. inakuweka on nini treatment immediately mm. alafu just time niko bila ha hii kitu kabla tuanze mtu wangu acha tuende so unaenda pale jo mtu wangu kuna have una have chemo mm. na uko hauna cancer hauna cancer what's that going to do to you jeez as in aliwamba ka watu kuna mm. mse moja ali mess kabisa ka daddy mm. alafu kuna mse black mm. mse black aliweka on chemo paka liver liver yake ikaharibika tu the level where he needed like a uh, liver t- uh, transplant mm. and now atakuwa na take drugs za anti rejection for the rest of his life mm. did not have cancer alafu wow. unajua mfanya mpaka sana fikiria if this can happen in america unajua triple k yeah what's happening in africa Because oh. don't forget this guy didn't do it because he hated people he did it for the love for of money. money yeah we come especially Kenyans we come from a country where it does not matter how you got rich Oof. as long as you got rich yeah so first of all i hope kwa kuna doctor na wachi la get some funny ideas because mm. it's just scary yani alafu super scary yeah. eh, but this also shows you like uh, get a second opinion a third opinion yeah always um, and try to get it as, as far as possible mm. like um say akikutreat hapa Nairobi akwambia na cancer kone zenda coast mm. we get a second opinion alafu the third opinion upate kisumu yeah alafu make sure it's people who can never cross paths yeah 
Kwa sababu hata hizo ni scary sana. Mm. Watu watu walikufa bana. Ndio kuma referral. Eh, hey. sana kurifa kwa doctor. <laughs> si ndio jo. Alafu best yake. Kitu fani ni hii historia hii raya US hata niko nafika kwa reception unapata yeah. waseka mbao wote <laughs> wanangoja ya kimo zi wako ndani ya nini wanachapua kimo alafu wati inasemekana like the whole of cause alikuwa msa iko based in Texas yeah. like there was no other oncology oncologist alikuwa na that many patients yeah um say during that period like a period of uh, uh, like in 2017 alone cause mm. ni kitu ya majuzi yeah. kitu ya majuzi eh yeah. Like uh, I think in 2017 ali Mazi like maybe 2013 there like there's a, a one specific year mm. where he treated 1500 patients 1500 yes wow so through these schemes zake he made over 17 million dollars i hope and i wrote in jail yeah, ali for 45 years yeah for that but unajua kenya uki make 17 million dollars that's 1.7 billion unaenda jail Uh, apana you not going to jail so so hii ni kitu ile tu tunaambia watu like if you go for a check up just no second third fourth opinion eh cause wa and what mm, ah alafu ninja iko white alafu na try that shit niko inaka arabic arabic inaitwa dr farid fata mtu anaweza baki unaweza i google ukitaka dr farid fata eh wow alafu me try that shit ah ilipatiwa 45 years kamba sasa wewe Yeah, alafu niko jua uh, niko shua jela uh, mm. check na yora. Watu check na. Yeah. So so kuna no story alafu uh, na tukika on more lighter stories nime like uh, digest a lot of Kenyan content mm. uh, during this uh, like a holy day ketu. Yeah. Holy day ni fake like. Hata tukita holy day. So like um So now let's go get my statistics from uh uh nani inaitwa YouTube eh? YouTube yeah. So YouTube ilituambia like wala acha niangalie um like audience yetu mm. zira zina to watch mm. uh like other people that they are watching so other people that they are watching Scully Graf Jones are we surprised no nope. um uh so Wakadinali no nope. yeah. uh NTV Kenya a little surprised is it yeah kiss 100 a little surprised uh, then kuna rain it was najita comic gang hold on hold on hold on uh, kiss 100 yes so there's a <laughs> kuna ka boy flani although yes see kiss is a classic eh. kuna boy flani hivyo na classic i'm sorry i forgot your name but shout out to you yeah. oh mso gani like die hard kwa hiko nini eh oh <laughs> ka boy flani hivi eh. wanakaita ka j call eh <laughs> Lakini <laughs> 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 so, uh, I hope ata 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 ni nini kimuita kwa babi. Asi babi ni ni compliment. Yeah. 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 So, yeah, ana ana kaga Jay Cole. Ni ana ka Yeah. So my boys will um, meet um, Jay Cole. Oh. So me work at joke by that name. Yeah. I, I can't remember his name. So ina ka hiyo nini yake infect yeah. other kids. Yeah, cuz anaambia yeah. kila mtu as in ni mse. Yeah. Anaambia kila have you watched this guy's report? You should watch it. It's dope. Hey, oh. <laughs> and I'm kila mtu ko ko office. Oh, that's dope. So I was like, yeah, yeah, shout out to my boy, man. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so kuna hiyo, alafu funny enough, my fans wa Willy Paul wanna watch. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah. I think was vile tunamwenye sana. Yeah. Okay, um alafu BTG News, BTG News ni wale walifanya gele interview ya umse anaitwa nani? Um Nasty C. Mm. Nasty C akisema ati hatafanya collab na Calligraph. Nah, okay. So kuna BTG. Mm. Uh, alafu nao place nili find interesting ni mm. come to comedy mm. watu wana watch Jalango. Mm-hmm. Alafu wana watch Abel Mtua. Mm-hmm. Alafu wana watch one of my favorite Kenyan comedians mm. Terence Creative. Mm. Cuz I find this nigga funny. <laughs> this and I'm one of those people who finds very few people funny. Mm but this nigga makes me laugh so uh eh alafu kuna hii moja wash wash sio 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 hiyo wote eh ni wash sio wash but one but two but mzee ana chemical eh ana nini amekuwa mzee irua eh don't you yeah my bowling gone ngai zingine eh alafu hiyo makeup hiyo makeup cuz is that ya is only ba blazo bleach like nigga alafu hizo sahawigi muslim mikono you notice so mikono iko dark mikono ni alafu huko iko all light skin and, uh, and uh, stuff uh, 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 so watu wana wana, wana watch Terence alafu pia wana watch uh, say wa Wololo TV mm. so Wololo TV ni wanaga kiwa na kina Terence mm. uh, wana muito catch so i don't know his real name oh. but kuna zile skits au do oh, so ina kwa kamsani okay. tu kagwe mm. 
Ah, kuna Terence na kuna Ninja. Uh, so wana duigi zingine zinto mutus you youtus <laughs> my guy <laughs> i think moja ulifata ni kiwa eh ile moja my guy nini like my motive yeah, my 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 motive my range my range nguizis so excuse me toka from gwanye stunguizis ni to nguizis eh is it right jo alafu aseni wafani mpaka ni vile si joani ningekuwa na joana nao personally mm. Ningetaka sana wa wa nini wa uh, wa reenact the story I'm hearing Jeve mm. cuz these are the guys who can actually do, do it, it yeah. Yeah. tag them niggas yeah, you know them <laughs> yeah cuz au, au nafikiri wanaweza wanza baki wamefanya wamefanya hiyo so mm. uh, oh still pia kwa audience yetu ni over 25 Oh, over 25 on watch yes, yes kuna watu ma fans over 25 na nice. watu tag them as well i want to yeah. meet them Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Zack, so, this nigga thirsty. <laughs> yeah, so um, so ni interesting kuona ma, ma, ma fan wetu. So kila pia tumeza sema like if uh, you watch any of these channels of course like subscribe these support, channels. Yeah, support. Eh yeah, kuzukiwa support pia nafanya ile YouTube inaona since una to support una support mm-hmm. ita encourage ma fans wow pia ku watch yeah. so check yeah. so it akuwa like a whole whatever thing so um uh, that's one of the things let me kwa uh, uh, so mm. online yeah, so kuja watch hizo skits za nini za especially wash 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 yeah but one part two yeah. uh, very funny very funny stuff eh yeah. <laughs> uh, alafu still um kuna mse anaitwa nani kuna best state fulani wa guy best massage states mm. Um, Dennis Dennis Gashanja mm. alibaki uh, ameli tag sio kali kutag mm. kwa video ya pasta nganga kiwa kwa church akipre mm. uh, so kuna hii uh, video ya pasta nganga akifanya ni inaitwa ngo exorcism mm. inaitwa ngo nini ile kutoa demon eh, exorcism yeah alikuwa anatoa demon kutoka kwa raia fulani yeah. uh, so kama kawaida so pasta nganga iko hapo eh, ana, ana pray naambia toka Toka nje. Of course nene anasema stoki. Eh. Kale kama sasa kuna demon. Sasa the demon inside the inside the stoki. Stoki. Yeah. How talk you naitwa nani? Naitwa komanda. Ka demon kana naitwa komanda. So kitu kwa fani ni wasitanganga ali slafira ya kwa chest. Ba, toka. Na doubt kai yule kwa kwa script. Iko sure after I see Rail go like eh you are not ready for if more just go get again eh ile kwa as when he did on oncologist and come you were at a cancer eh eh obviously smack your chest eh jo ali ali go go design ne ndiko sure ali get out of the niche out of character and just like like eh twangu you are acting here when let's eh Oh. Apaka niko naambia nani niko naambia uh, Deno mm. Deno Gashanja niko naambia like uh, I actually want to visit church ya Nganga yeah. like the last time I was in church I think was uh, like I took myself to church mm. the last time was 1998 okay yeah so I want to go to church and mm. if I have to go to church nataka kwenda kwa church ya Nganga mm. nataka kuona kana za record because I'll have the Yeah. best time of my life <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, time, well, miracles yeah, now yeah. yeah, yeah, you yeah. know the thing is like google stopped uh, making them the, the glasses they were making remember those yeah, the, yeah, yeah. those would have been the best cuz size you can place your order on a smartphone once you record what was up kushuk eh kwa sababu mse alikuwa na record ni kali kwa meji feature but sasa nini wame come up nazo so mechi kizima rayban na rayban na facebook okay wame come up na search lakini sasa shida cause of privacy yeah. is in our card so they actually ah, show that they are recording that they are recording yeah that's the yeah. Yeah. so there are places you can get away with that kati ya taoni za kukitembea tu lazima aka red watu tako like nini mbaya na huyu mtu but kwa pasta nganga ana eh ana kuna shetani ingine pale yo nini nyakudu hawa eh hapo ni za za leta shida za leta shida eh eh um uh, so um, another thing uh, j podcast ni uh, buda zaka anza kwa kitu join atuko 100% sure. uh, yeah he was supposed to join but 
Sijika bado sijika amelala au nini nini. Eh, uh, which hakuna shida. Mm, but, yeah, but, eh, but if it happens it happens yeah. um um nafa kuchapiana na story kadha. Eh, eh mm. za za, za majuju mm. uh, buda zako ga maju. Mm. Uh, so inza kwa interesting ku, ku check nini. So yeah. another thing that really happened tukiwa holiday mm. uh, ni Jimmy Wanjigi alibaki ame <laughs> amepatiana ni alipatia ni Eric Mondi Chrysler. Mm. Chrysler Crossfire. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so of course ma Kenya itakuwa like billionaire gifts na ni ya 50 million shilling car that, no, car, that car is the worst yeah, uh, so uh, okay, no, okay let, me not, let me let me not, <laughs> let me not let me get into yeah, yeah, the but, thing but it's is, not a 50 million shilling car it's a very good car <clears throat> and it looks beautiful yeah it looks beautiful yeah, that's yeah. that's what you can say about yes, it yes, it's yes. an american car yes yes i'm sorry like it's an american car yeah oh, they look you're good not a fan of american no. cars plastic yeah, yeah. So so much kwatu has kwagi like a uh, fuel efficient but most of them is made of plastic yeah like now so apart from camaro mm. and uh, maybe the ford is it ma, ma, yeah. muscle cars unta kunembea yeah apart from those muscle cars yeah. of which badoni compared to basically they just bad cars yeah imagine a v8 mm. a v8 kitu ka 4.6 liter v8 mm. I was to harvest more than maybe 400 horsepower out of that car. Mm. A Japanese 1.2 in harvest <laughs> over 600 uh oh. horsepower. Yeah. So it's, it's like me wangalia to they're not uh, oh. gatuni za vishasha. Ukiziona mm. ziko mm. aggressive mm. ziko nini but if you put a, a even a Camaro next to a, a an Evo 10 or Evo 9 mm. ai Oh, sasa yes, zashanga. <laughs> Sio yeah. najua. Okay. Yeah, hizo gari Camaro tu na, na there's another one. There's the the Camaro and then there's the GT 500. Hizo mm. ndio cuz zilikuwa kwa, kwa movie. The only thing about them is that they were in like yeah. some very famous movies. Mm. So people always try to mm. go in yeah, but the American cars are just shit. I'm okay. sorry. But now it gets more interesting cuz Jimmy and Jiggy when you see like one of the reasons I may get nani I may get um anaitwa uh um say to uh like Eric Komondi Eric Komondi yeah. ni amsaidia na stories za campaigns cuz he's campaigning mm. apparently on an ODM ticket mm. anataka kuwa the president 2022 yeah so akamwa ku do like a Kenya tour yeah uh so ku do a Kenya tour in like something kamwambia like it's good to go to like ODM strongholds mm. lanza wajaka mm. so one mm. of the places ila lienda ni akaenda Migori. Mm. Alafu Migori kama kawaida sio wakiwa na zile mandai zao kuna kuwa na kale ka, ka, ka nini ni ka sunroof. Mm. So sunroof kuna vile wao inatolewa hivi alafu una stick mm, as a true politician. Mm. Eh yeah, sio vile au kanyaga nini kwa kwa ndani. I think ni viti. Eh. Mm. So kuna kitu kanyaga alafu you address the nation. <laughs> the, the nation. So msaja kama hapo like nini ODM? <laughs> Nikisema ODM nasema fuck if yani okay si yako nasema hivi. <laughs> Hako na accent ya kijaka but eh nikisema ODM mnasema fagia so unajua ni some rich dude shit yeah afu ODM fagia ODM fagia ah come say kingine uko nyuma ya si nataka baba bwana ra mawe karusho msali rudi uko ndani je alisahau yani billionaire ali ra eh kama mimi na like um Uh, kama nataka kwenda ku challenge baba in quotes yeah. uko jakani unafaa duties unafungwa ile sandroof alafu rai na tupama eh una practice ku ku stick kicho inje na ndani na ndani eh cuz filera hii lingeko ndani ai eh ilikuwa mpaka fasta kutushinda you go like hey this nigga is good <laughs> Ndio ndio tiki mali kuna kwa gana crowd car hizo. Mm. Unapata ga, like maybe 95% of the people hataki kurusha mali. Yeah, like, yeah. They're not even thinking about it. Mm-hmm. But as soon as raya moja imerusha yeah. wana get ai mm. kusana vile hiyo raya ukiwatch your clip vile yeah. rusha mawe yeah. i don't think anyone else threw a stone after that. Yeah. Like you know you don't want to confirm. Hawezi <laughs> baki pale ati mimi mwana huyo bwana. Hapo na japo sema ni mwanaume wewe wewe ni mwanaume kwa sababu nasema hauna ngozi ine zetu wewe ni mwanaume ra sanyo kwa kada vizuri but pia ilifanya nikafikiria juu ya ira ya moja the philosopher moses kuria 
Vila alisikia hii story like what he said. Jose Nyonga Moses Kuria wa the philosopher. Mm. And his famous uh, methalini the foreskin misleads the mind. Oh. Yes, yeah, Nyonga so mm. yo. Waga like saying yo raya like during every election cycle. Lazima I bring up so yeah the foreskin misleads the mind. So niko sure ah uh, ka walibonga na wanjigi after that anaambia <laughs> tu nilikuwa bia foreskin misreads the mind. <laughs> oh kasema <laughs> Eh kasema unaenda huko eh cuz eh I'm sorry ni bamba sana. Ah lakini uh, when all is said and done of course this is funny mm. but it's not something that should be encouraged as in hata politicians yeah. waonge. <coughs> waonge. Yeah. If you don't agree with what they're saying mm. si lazima ukwe kwa hiyo meeting unaweza enda mtaani. Yeah yeah. yeah. Eh cuz hiyo ni ndio kitengine afu na kamseka comedian fulani kanaitwa Henry Desagu. Mm. Ah uh, Desagu ni yule mse pia alifanyaga skit na nani na Terence. Mm. Ila ti amechukua uh, range. This guy is in my range oh. selling me wa. You selling me wa in my range you guys. Na kumbuka hiyo. Na kukomsa akiuza viazi ma skuma sijui ma range. Kwa range. Alafu ni vogue. Eh sasa hiyo unajua alikuwa ameomba at least you anaenda kupika dem fulani. So kuzo ameona eh boy wangu anaenda kuchukua dem. Mm. acha tumpatie ka yeah. karenji yeah. eh mzee alikuja kuipata kwa barabara inauza mayai na maskuma <laughs> yani yeah. mamiwa yeah. Yeah. so you say uh, you can um, like his fictitious character a uh, politician kana itwa wangombe mm. and uh, i'm thinking it's actually na you know ile ni kai na gain some momentum okay. i wouldn't be surprised that his stand as wangombe hata anaweza nini anaweza nini yeah <laughs> so nikitoa mianzisha <clears throat> as a joke so wangombe ni ka politician Hakuna hada ngani? Hmm. Anaambia mimi nitakuja hapo kujiendeleza nini <laughs> ni shauri yenu. Eh, it's about me <laughs> which is actually true. Yeah, major. that's yeah. Eh, uh, cuz Kenyan politicians do that for themselves, Najer. Uh, wow. Alafu boy wako alifanya interview uh, na CEO wa Pals, um, Senator Charles Otieno. Mm. Uh, Julian. Check it. Ah, siku check your interview. Uh, so yeah. sit wa wakabonga. So they talk about different stuff. Yeah. Abonga juu like uh, career yake. Mm. Like he took a break. Cuz no kwa kuna time Julian was everywhere. Yeah. Then uh, anasema he take a break of like three years alafu mm. akarudi. Uh, so akaulizwa mleza ku date Lee na Udem. Mmeza tu majuzi. Mm. Up around June. Okay. Yeah, see kitu time yako for that long. Mm. Yeah, but anasema she's a lady of clarity, she's a lady of purpose. Eh mimi nikikuwa ningewapo ningewa Shia za hotel. <laughs> Shia za hotel. <laughs> eh alafu mimi najua ni ngombe design. Um naweza dungia nani? Naweza dungia mtua. Mm. Kwa sababu kitu moja tupatie game tour uh, credit for. Mm. Tour is the one who made the government spokesman position to mean something. Yeah. Like right now who's the government spokesman? I have no idea. Na time mtu uko najua. Si ndio? Yeah. <clears throat> Like after mtua kumekuwa na sijui ACP sus juu nani but mm. no hakuna presence yeah so mtu alikuwa na presence yeah. so that's one of the things like we know him i know him nikifikaji nake i think of him as a government spokesman more than yeah. even as the governor of oh, machako machako so, yeah. mm. and then of course there's the other thing yeah si unajua mshawa kuna eh 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 ni kitoto juagi mtu ndio alisaidia ga shoot uh, video ya justice <laughs> ya justice na vile kwa hiyo sote kwa justice niko nimechomea nani amos wako si unajua eh yeah. eh but yura yeye alisaidia gana hiyo yeah. alafu pia alikuwa gana ya cobra squad yeah, yeah. Cobra. so eh <laughs> so ni, ni, ni interesting sana so yeah. um so mtu wa uh, mimi ninge kwa juliani mm. leza mtu kwa rasa mm. eh yeah. sina chukua tu phone au dem na tik namba ya mtu alafu nampiga mm. kran kran go like ah, hello mr mtu yeah, mm. how, how are you uh, it's me uh, it's juliani um so i think we need to have this conversation now it's better we have it now than later mm. uh, it's about a and l hotel um i think uh, you should also add my name to it <laughs> <laughs> like uh, um, a and l and j yeah? I'm, i'm part of the family now. yeah i'm part of the family you know zia alafu na mbia so ni a l and j does not even sound right so <laughs> let's try jal j a l yani na mkatia i took your bitch now coming for your hotel 
inaweza kuwa rasa sana ngani yani za jam na wewe je just spoil his day kabisa yeah, yeah. so um yeah but this nigga is out here doing interviews um so but yeah actually think mtua is a bigger man than a lot of people yeah um because eh, yeah kuna mse fulani hapo alisema ingekuwa ni yeye yeah Eh, ile ra yetu ya death certificate. Eh, yeah, mgeji wa hamjui. Eh, yeah. hako yeah, anacheka na mtu. Eh, yeah, yeah. so, so yeah, lazima so it's a good thing hana some fly chick somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Watu wanatamani. Otherwise yeah. ingekuwa <laughs> ingekuwa ni shida <laughs> kwa shida jua shida. Yeah, ile wezi nyang'anya kitu yote. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so um, alafu tukiruka tuende US kidogo um tubongejea technology. Mm. Uh, Michelin wanasema by the year 2024. Mm atakuwa ki release tire zilizotumia air airless tires. Oh, zile ni cars. Eh, ni so ni tire hivi alafu imekuwa tunini katikati hizo. Yeah, so, kuna na car kuna spaces yeah, more spaces bene. alafu yeah. Yeah, So I've wanasema seen. by 2024 yeah. alafu zitakuwa ki last at least three times longer than is ingine. Is ingine. Wamekuwa ki research for over 15 years yeah. so wanasema prices zitakuwa mbaya sana. Mm. And I actually think that's a good idea cuz not my air puncture whatever whatever. Yeah, it's all ga stress yeah. Yeah, yeah. So the only was, the bad thing about it is like <clears throat> with every good thing yeah. it will get into the hands of some bad people. Yeah. So imagine <clears throat> so easy is <laughs> mag- magariza maorezo. Yeah. Ile kitu waga inasaidia ni vile ziko na tires ziko zinaji inflate yeah, zenye yeah, si ndio yeah. so sasa mmekimbishwa na ka thegi fulani mm. umeepa so una shooting hiyo tires za yeah, yeah, so yeah. size huwezi ah, ah, <laughs> unless we rip kabisa eh yeah. kama mseka atakuja yeah, so katakuja tu so yeah. itabidi tafute yeah. vile <laughs> vile mnaweza di, distract yeah. ma terrorists yeah, yeah. 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 eh wakio kwanza jio ma hilux yeah. <laughs> <laughs> lakini hizo hizo raya nafikiri uh, terrorist on their side i think there is kuna kuogana ile level ya how target a target that's not very hard to mm. understand mm. so akiona like um hata kifika hiyo hiyo level i'm sure kutakuwa na weaknesses mm. za hiyo tire mm. and they'll just exploit yeah. there has to be cause uh, if uh, you get into the wrong hands yeah yeah eh, you can't shoot your way out of it Mm, mm. itabidi wao mkushika tu yeah, but at least itakuwa yeah yeah itakuwa something good uh, so apart from that um still to stick na US kuna story ya Kim Kardashian kuna kama sekana jitanga work 100 unakujua i hate that nigga yeah but yeah kwa gani manager wa nani alikuwa manager wa the game or something yeah, ni rasa kabisa sasa hizi imetokea okay, inasema ati kuna sex tape ya nani ati ya Kim Kardashian na Ray J another sex tape yeah. lafu sketch like na kinasema i don't want any money from it i just want to personally hand it over to Kanye West <laughs> Okay so na chega but that's just some sucker shit Yeah like Kanye iko bali na donda yake na shindo like what the hell is going Yeah destroyed? like why De- destroy it then if Yeah you... destroy it if you don't need anything just destroy it Destroy it, it. just yeah Eh yeah, lakini like Kim Kardashian kaka zi hakuna video nyingine tu record ile moja <laughs> <laughs> Kama toa hizo kama yeah. dismiss your story kasema oh msana tafuta Uh, uh publicity yeah who um so organ him say anyway like i said i hate that nigga yeah he's he's just full of shit yeah kuna vitu zingine zile how 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 fai kubonga juu yake eh mm. alafu sasa um nataka tuende kwa story nyingine alafu hii segment ras duty ifanyaje mm. but kuna hii podcast um ya math hofa mm. uh, so math hofa alibaki ame invite lord jama mm. na smoke diza mm. anani tena kulikuwa na watu kana five, five live mics eh uh, five live mic waga ni mse i think ana ame sign na pitrock either ame sign yeah. na pitrock ama yeye do yeah. uh, projects na pitrock yeah mm. so uh, so alikuwa invited and lafu a conversation started mm. and the conversation was about um so we are trying to have as much english in this segment as possible as possible yeah so that they so can understand because we want to address these motherfuckers yeah Sorry. so that they can understand what you're talking about so mm. one of the things that they talked about was uh moving back to africa mm. and uh this is where it gets <clears throat> funny mm. and ignorant mm. uh because one of the things that smoke teaser says 
mm. is uh, there's a guy called Kevin Townsend mm. who's in Africa mm. for 10 years mm. and has not seen uh, a, a lawyer, judge, yeah. a lawyer or a judge for 10 years. Mm. <clears throat> so the ignorance comes from the fact that Africa is not a country. <laughs> so there's no way you can say that someone is in jail in Africa and has not seen a judge. You have to talk about the specific country. Country, yeah. That's like someone being in jail in where Mexico, mm. and you so complaining easy. that mm-hmm. that someone is in America yeah. in jail. In yes, jail. Mexico is part of North America. Yes, but Mexico is a country. Yeah, different rules, different everything. Yeah, so there's that factor. And then these guys are in jail for what attempt a murder or something. Mm. And uh, you don't want to be in, in Africa, any country in Africa, and be arrested for murder. Mm. Does not matter which country you're from. Yeah. Your fact, yeah. yeah, so there's that factor where there is Africa is a continent with 54 countries, yeah, and out of these 54 countries, there is no common food. <laughs> like, if I cross over to Uganda, which is right next to Kenya, their food is different from Kenyan food, yeah, and even in Kenya, food is different, <laughs> as in, yeah, like you. <laughs> Just lumping everything under Africa just makes you ignorant as fuck. Yeah. Yeah. We don't have anything like at African food or an African language. No. We have so many, like Kenya alone, the average African speaks three languages. Yeah. We speak English, we speak Swahili, and, and we speak our mother tongue. Our mother tongue, yeah. That's the average African. Mother tongue is like a tribal language. Yeah. You know, that Madingo shit. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how else to explain to it. To explain so, it, yeah. Uh, the average African speaks three languages. Uh, so with these three languages comes, like, there's a culture that comes with that. Yeah. So every distinct language has its own distinct sort of culture. culture yeah. Like, for example, which example? Let's use Obama. Yeah. Obama comes from... Like as uh, like his father came from a, a section of people called Luos. We are trying to educa- educate you. They are known to love fish. Yeah, Americans are l- known to love chicken. In Africa, uh, like in Kenya specifically, the tribe that's known to love chicken is called Luya. You see, mm. but we all love chicken. But still, as in, there is nothing like someone is in jail in, in Africa. Africa. You have to <laughs> talk about the specific country. Yeah. So that was annoying. Yeah. But apart from that being annoying, what was even more annoying was Lord Jama. Mm. Lord Jama, I'm known to be a Branubian fan. I'm the biggest <laughs> yes. Branubian. I've quoted Lord Jama on this podcast, Return of the Dread. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. When there was all that beef between Lord Jama and Eminem, who did we side with? Jama. Then he says the most ignorant shit. <laughs> I don't look like anyone in Africa. Why? Because <laughs> you're light skinned? Because why else would you say you don't look like anyone in Africa? Because you're light skinned. Or, or why else? That, and, and then mm. are there light skinned Africans? Yeah. Anyway, that, that part, that part I can I can I can what do they say? The, the, you can excuse him for that. For that. We'll come back to that. Soon. We'll come, yeah. Because yeah. basically he says he looks more like a Mayan. Yeah, than an African, which is yeah true. If you look at Lord Jama, he's uh, well, he's just light skinned This looks like any other. No, but his facial is. If you look at his face, yeah, the structure mm. is more like uh, <clears throat> those 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 Indians, the the red Indians. The, but still, the structure you, of the yeah, the structure of the face, because I can still say yeah. like he looks Somalian, Ethiopian. Yeah, one of those. You see, so it's still up. Yeah, but made the one thing that he said that I, I, I was like, for someone like you, five percenter, you nation of Islam, you're yeah. supposed to be educated, you're supposed to know all this shit. For him to say that uh, the indigenous people in America were black, so yeah. there was no need for Americans to come to Africa to take slaves. To take slaves. Yeah. Is the most retarded shit I've ever heard. Like nigga, we there's history books, there's we some of us we have uh, grandfathers who talk about how their grandfather escaped yeah. being captured. Yeah. As in this story is there people can see that you know slavery like they came and took people mm-hmm. from Africa by force. Yeah. So this nigga is like that story, any conspiracy theory. 
to I him the, 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 the indigenous people were black in america so the the whole thing of uh getting Africans. people from africa is mm-hmm. is is false to him yeah. which is just stupid yeah but, but you see the problem i had with this whole i don't look anything like an african is mm. first of all he does a podcast that has radiga and godfrey mm. godfrey is of nigerian descent <laughs> yes so um so godfrey is more dark skinned than you otherwise why, why would you say you don't look because if you ask me like how do africans look i don't know because <laughs> we're just black we're just black and we're different different shades of black they're yeah. very light skinned africans yeah and they're super dark skinned africans yeah like uh the most dark skinned africans are from uh sudan, sudan. Mm. south sudan to be yeah, specific south, yeah south sudan the most light skinned i don't know Like, probably in the in the northern parts of africa yeah uh, but those are arabs let's forget about the arabs let's then, just talk about like then pure pure it will have to be like coast coastal people yeah coastal people and in every country there are a lot yeah uh a lot of light light skinned people so uh, and this is the other thing that i find i always find interesting with americans is the fact that they make jokes about someone being dark skinned oh you're so dark skinned oh you so that's white supremacy <laughs> fucking with your mind doesn't yeah, exactly. africa we don't mind being we, dark, dark like yeah we that's yeah. as in, <laughs> we take pride in that shit like yeah. I'm black and yeah. I'm proud you know so yeah. so we had to address that and, and one uh, of the other things i thing... say this as a uh, as a lol jama fan as in i love brand nubian more than i love him i don't fuck with him in his music yeah but that brand nubian shit like i've always fucked with that but there's this level of ignorance of like i've even had an american say that black people in africa are not black people some bullshit like that yeah like the only black people are americans so like and then oh the bullshit of do africans hate black americans i keep hearing this shit yeah <laughs> we like do african hate, hate any anyone we don't hate anyone yes that's a funny thing we don't hate like, and i think that was the thing that made it so easy for our forefathers to be captured because yeah. to them it was all good yeah. about yeah. a week ago yeah <laughs> until, <laughs> until they found themselves on a boat yeah yeah we don't hate anybody we don't care yeah and that's what because and i hate when people say this shit like africans hate black americans the first thing africa has 54 countries <laughs> these 54 countries have very different cultures yeah but the few ones that we know like mm. the pure black people mm. don't hate anyone it's all love the only country where africans are attacked by other africans not black americans mm. it's africans attacked by other africans mm. is south africa yeah and south africa is coming from apartheid mm white supremacy yeah where the black man is looked at as less yeah of a human so of like... course if the white man is setting the standards mm-hmm. you're going to hate your fellow black man mm-hmm. so you have to look at that so this is like the ultimate bullshit africans don't hate black americans we are you've never them. been to africa <laughs> shut the fuck up <laughs> exactly we've been to your country africans and we, we travel a lot that's yeah. a, the other the other difference <laughs> like we know so much about the world yeah and then you had the other thing the guy was saying that um there's a level of corruption in africa when they were talking about like moving to africa and the reason they wouldn't come to africa they're like yo the level of corruption in that country in in in, in africa is crazy yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, basically poverty and all that yeah. so i was like listen um that we have family members in yeah. the states yeah. who tell us that there are parts of new york they go to that look worse than our ghettos here. Yeah. You get. Yeah. So it depends on what part of 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 the country you go to. Mm. Like even in Kenya, there are people who don't believe Madari exists because yeah. they've never been there. Yeah. You understand? Yeah, Madari is a slum, a true slum. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> so the same way we see states and we think like everything is oh, it's fruity and everything, but there are parts of that like there are some ghettos there you go to the elevators are just full of shit yeah yeah the the but, but even <laughs> apart from that i think there's something still lord jama said like mm. uh the police there will extort you yes the police will extort you the police uh, they take will... like uh half a dollar half 50 a, cent 50 cent 
and you and let you go let you go to your, by your business american cops will shoot you will shoot you there's a difference yeah african cops are not afraid for their lives every time going <laughs> to be shot without being armed you must have done some shit <laughs> some shit but yeah. if you're armed you're not surrendering they're <laughs> dropping your ass so all that fake gangster shit can't work in africa, in africa yeah so there's that but we had to take this is a podcast that's normally done in swahili sheng we have we had to take like a fucking intermission and to just address this nigga address the bullshit yeah yeah so that was that it's, yeah so still all what you to do the story said so so tuongejia nini sasa eh kama ni muamerica ishia ishia tafunguza matako kwa mbele si chato kwa hiyo story eh so hiyo ndio shida au tuelee hii tunakuelewa tunakuelewa hiyo mzee ameniudi yani ah mimi nikatia sana but maybe to take your intermission to to bongejia story kwa sababu nani inani katsi ya kabisa history ya kuchukua africa mzima as a country eh alafu jina and then the only place they know is probably nigeria eh eh ah sisi alafu unajua sisi hata tuna shida na nigeria tunapenda nigeria tunapenda godfrey godfrey wa gano mse yeah that's what kitu inani katsi ya like mm. godfrey wa based in iraq mm. but iraq somehow inaamua kuchukua africa sju africa imedu nini mm. eh cuz hii continent tunaipenda sana iko na ujinga mob yeah iko na ujinga mob like but this is when taku hapa siwezi toka eh cuz mimi sina god dreams za kwenda majuu ai kuna okay. countries zinazotaka ku visit lakini mm. kwenda kuishi kuishi no especially states just states that iko age kwa haiko kwa hiyo radar states yeah. imetanika kwa it's basically in kitulisema it's a rich third world country yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. states has become a rich third world mm. country lakini kama kuna countries zinazotaka kuishi kakininukia na ibidi niende pale mm. ni zinataka kwenda kwa ile country ya zile raya matata mm. kaskoro ni zile raya no way no raya eh hayo ni countries zinataka kwenda pia kale kademka biashara ni biashara stella STL. oh yeah yeah eh yuko huko yeah. usikite zafanya nitaka kwenda huko ni ni crime mm. ni kwa shida ni kidu crime <laughs> jela eh jela ni holiday jo <laughs> shani so jela za nini yeah, no way jo uh, hazina wall <laughs> uko na ka room kako yeah basically internet computer yeah. unajitengenezea kati yabe pale yeah, yeah. Basically on a restrict to was it would be back to society yeah. and how we corrected yeah. cuz yeah. those are correctional facilities not CD even jail mm. yeah yeah jail yeah. ziko huko Africa na states eh yeah. eh yeah. cuz Africa utakubali eh yeah. hapa hivi unaweza kubali mtu wangu mm. mm. afuna Africa saa shida ni mbaya tunasikia raia pia zina zinaondoana mm. kumekuwa na uh, kuna raia fulani ya Kenya imekuwa kidu rounds mob sana ilienda gajela mm. um so kwa kwa kidu rounds kiambia sasa vile kuna homosexuality alafu somehow haikupatiana rasa niko like uh, uh, umeenda four stations ukiambia na kupatiana rasa sasa naanza kukususpect right? like no ila yeye do interviews mob kabisa ime do interview na switch eh. ime do interview na ode mnaitwa mungai hivi ime do interviews juu na nani na everywhere kienda watu walikuwa wanapatiana matako lakini mimi sikupatiana matako <laughs> <laughs> nani amekuuliza? <laughs> huh? Nani amekuuliza? Eh, tupatiana simu jela tuone. Jela haiko. Ah, huyu alikuwa face wangu. Mwambie na miss. Let me broke his. Raina ni katsi. Kuna raia iko kila pahali. Jaja check. Uh-uh iko kila pahali kumekuwa na hizo jinga alafu kuna um, interview fulani hizi interview za, za, za Kenya ni vile YouTube haijuagi uh, language uh. otherwise uh, kuna nyingine academic nyingine alikuwa na interview Charlie Anga alikuwa hama so alikuwa anakuja kana nuka mavi gosh dang eh sa nakwambia ni vile YouTube haijui YouTube ingekuja hiyo shit ingekuwa pulled down haraka je unaweza inaja usisahau bado mlami ni ana sign check na, na mlami hataki kujua yeah. mlami hata wende place inanuka shonde <coughs> mtu wangu tulia tu mm. eh kwa sababu umse umse wa CEO CEO wa nini wa Apple mm. Tim Cook wa Tim Cook yeah si ndio yeah Tim Cook wa um, so Tim Cook wa gay so kama uko anti gay ufike to me iPhone me i think unafaa kufika hiyo level by the way kama iPhone stumiagi ni washoga vitu za Apple stacki 
Na sisi situpatie hiyo mtu wangu. Situpatie tu. Hii inanuka mahavi ni mimi. Era hiyo ni babaga sana. Afrika Afrika joga. Tunakoka na ujinga zetu. Yaani tunapenda hii kitu. Unaacha kitu tunaponga kiswa. Hatuonyeshi uchi mbele ya Lord Jamaa. Sasa tumevangoza. Tuna discuss hii story. Waje tu discuss tu kivi yetu. Afrika si uchoma. Ya si uchoma. Eh lakini tunaipenda. Hii hii ni continent tunaipenda sana. Azimi siwezi taka kuishia. And yeah. Place ingine yote azi. Cuz kuna kuna Okay tuseme ile place umezaliwa mm. kuna freedom flani uko nayo na kuna vile una feel comfortable nayo mm. mm. because for me nikienda place yote mm. naweza ku like siwezi kupenda ku break rules zao zile wa yeah, yeah, zile country yeah, yeah. that's why going to Saudi Arabia all these countries i don't i don't yeah. when i see people going there and then come back with stories of how they were being mistreated blah 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 mm. i don't get it like why did you go in the first place i'm sorry as is Saudi Arabia mm. people go for economic reasons that's why ni had sana uski an african complaining about treatment in america europe uh on any cuz you don't know those societies where if you just integrate hakuna mm. shida yeah cuz africans one thing about sisi like the only people wale neza sema wako na shida na hii mm. was about north africa mm. so like the egyptians yeah. the moroccans mm. najua wale like arabs mm. An Arab ataenda Germany mm. na anze kuona mademo ako half naked ako offended. Yeah. And that's not your country. Sisi tukienda pale what was your name? Why you are voice of Hollywood? Eh. Bwana hii maisha ni mzuri. Yeah, because for me that this for me that's like if if that society that's what I want to say okay and Rome you live as the Romans. Mm, mm, so mimi mm. nikienda hata nikienda if I choose to go to a country and find that some of their laws are like super strict mm, mm. they go against the human rights and all that mm. but I I'm there mm. I will have to abide by those laws yeah, yeah. it's as simple as that yeah kama kama uko panyoka but nikiamua kwenda kuishi China yeah ah ndio so if so you don't want to you yeah. stay where you are mm. and that's the reason I'm staying here because me the, I know kuna vitu siezi mm. as kuna vitu zinaweza fanya siezi survive malika state mm. yeah, unaweza enda states mazee ile mtu anakukosea tu heshima tu unaambia kule kwetu mazee mtu uchapo kibare eh unaona lakini kujo haita unatoa unatoa gun so una check hapo it's already not a fair fight yeah because rai imekubali kukufa imekubali exactly me I still want to live Mm, for like mm. another 50. Kwa sasa imenikumbusha kuna hii documentary ya I think kuna need we watch kuna mm. documentary ya BBC. Mm. Imetokea this past weekend. Uh ni juu ya Big na Tupac. Mm. Um so imeangaliwa from <coughs> kuna ka white boy flani kama ndio hiyo documentary. Ni find kiwa interesting sana because mm. uh like people who are interviewed wanasema nani was a very is it to influence guy i've never looked at it from that point tupac yeah. like tupac was a very easy to influence type of person yeah. like you can even see uh like kesame and ajela sindio yeah. interscope kama lenga because yeah. tupac alikuwa on death row for how long let's start with that like when you think about death row tupac alikuwa there for how long 90 just think about it yeah for a very short time Yes, very short time. 11 months. Cuz yeah, when he was in jail. Yes. So before joining na death in 11 months. Mm. But we think like he was there for a lifetime. Mm. Why? Cuz he changed his whole persona. Mm. Tupac was never a thug. Ukisikiza album zake za before. Yeah. Hapa. Yeah. Hakuwa that kill nigga whatever mm. Mm. Shit. but he was so easy to influence that bila lienda hivi aka change his all whole persona mm. aka kuwa thug aka yeah, kuwa yeah. afira yake kwa namcheza tu mm. namcheza do mm. moteki um, so alikuwa kuna time like uh, madhake like a step madhake fulani mm. ma madhake namba 2 le lanangi kwa close na yeye mm. alikuwa mwambie eh hey, mtu wangu unaangalia gata nini account accounting books mm. hako anaona chochote Mm. so he was being robbed he was whatever mm. but all this fake thug persona was not him mm. uh, uh, i at influence ilikuwa so fast that since inija ilikuwa blood mm. 
yeye pia akaanza kuvaa vitu za red mm, na cheki mm, yeah, mm, yeah. mm. eh, but kifala chenye pia unajua kile grow up kaa kibabi unajua hivyo like Park. uh zizi zi, zi, shoot night yeah. ukiangalia standards za america yeah. kinatoka from a very good family <laughs> nini lakini sasa akikaanza ku hang out around thugs yeah. So no it's like a big work thug. Oh. So to be a thug it'll be a push to the next level. It's a mm. very interesting documentary. Oh. Yeah, and it was to the what that the beginning and the end I'm going to come you. It could be BBC. Oh, I'll, yeah, I'll check it out. Just CC yani na chokora chokora internet. But a BBC for free. Yeah. For free, yeah. Um, so mtote <laughs> um eh, endo search BBC documentary Tupac Biggie. It's very interesting. But ifanya nikaangalia Tupac from a very different uh, perspective. Siko nafikiria hivyo unajua ngafikini say independent minded alafu naambwa mm. ngalio mse at 17 what he used to talk about mm. and at 25. It's mm. like alikuwa na get retarded with time instead with time. of grow. Ku grow yeah. Ku grow as a human. So so kuna hiyo. So ilikuwa episode 32 um kama kawaida like, subscribe, share. Uh, share hit the notification button. Yeah. Uh, ka add ka kicheza tufai kukuambia hii lakini tafadhali kwa unaweza acha hiyo ndio time ya kwenda kukojoa. Yeah. Uh, unaweza cheza hata na bibi ukiona ni add ya 10 minutes cheza cheza na bibi kidogo. <laughs> <laughs> At least yeah. eh, uh, 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 fanya kitu. Yeah. Yeah, alafu tuone kunendaje but tuna appreciate sana uh, a thousand uh, subscribers kwetu. It's, yeah, a it's a lot. Um, those those are people we're talking to like directly. Yeah, yeah. lakini kuna hii kitu kwa stats jo like uh watu wana to watch mm. how many are unsubscribed. So subscribers ni 78%. Mm. Kuna 21% wale hawako subscribe. Hawako subscribe. Maze subscribe so, and then hit the the like button. It won't cost you anything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Just yeah. hit the the like. Eh, uh, alafu um anomaly so mali za na ujinga lakini leo kuna ujinga. Ya kuna ujinga mabo leo hata tu. Eh, isha tu. Isha. Ile isha tu hiyo. Za ndo. Ndio. Hakuna kadem liko sana during a nini? Ni period. Zi. Yeah. I'm a nice oh. I'm a nice I'm a nice person. But kitu interesting me happen during a period ni vitu mbili. Mm. Nilipata na storage ya raya mbili zangu na dem moja. Mm. One of the dudes watched but fit it's the dude who was screwing the girl mm. so that dude was just kabisa <laughs> yeah, ninja me bambika sana you know na any legend i love you yeah. you remember the dude that i was a therapist to yeah shit that nigga watched the episode man like what the fuck serious yeah like you said you're like eh hey, mwafu ni afu ni mse mse ni mjanja ukitaka kutio mse ni mjanja msali nianzia like eh mwafu ni haja Tayari na ndaga kwa podcast uh, asizi unambia kwa nini wapenda kuvaa socks azifanani mm. ashindwa amaanisha nini amopenda kuvaa podcast uh, nini socks azifanani mm. kanambia na cheki podcast ashindwa like fuck <laughs> na cheki podcast so nikasema wacha ni check ni episode gani mm. ni vaa socks azifanani <laughs> ile episode ya wash wash mm. socks azifanani mm. alafu tulibonga juu yake mm. Yeah, uh, fit this nigga has a sense of humor. He's story really limbamba. Yeah. I was like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay. okay. So, yeah. hey. damn. You like I I didn't know to keep say what. I was like, damn. <laughs> yeah, so come to watch episode of Wash Wash. Oh. Yeah, and we check it. Okay. So, so like Hey, we're going to create alliance drama for you both. See, see, see. Ali Ali find nini? Yeah. Mm, I guess at the end of the day to nabonga your life um, yeah. um, um, the person who would be offended would be this other nigga ule ndo wake ana ana kamatwa she's being kamatwa bwana you guy she's being kamatwa you guy my yeah. guy yeah. by another guy who is a guy eh zaka bemeko mutu is my guy so ekhadene ekhadene